Trump is not a fascist. He's a right-wing populist. So, uh, about, I guess to put it in sensationalist terms, Trump would prefer South African apartheid state over Nazi Germany. Which I admit, that's a little sensationalist to say. But the point is that what he advocates for, right-wing populism, is different from fascism, while it still has an, like an ethnic nationalist component to it. One big difference is that right-wing populism still advocates for democracy, that there should be some kind of democracy. They just tend to believe that uh, certain groups of people might not uh, get all the rights that they actually should get. And they might be just more oppressive towards unlike ethnic groups like Muslims. Which I, yeah, issues are complicated and this video is very short so it's oversimplifying a complicated issue. So yeah, that's a big difference. Fascism wants a dictatorship, right-wing populism like uh, Trump and all the right-wing populism that's going on in Europe. They still want a democracy. They don't want a revolutionary government. That's another thing too is that uh, fascism advocates like the overthrow of the entire system in favor of a utopian revolutionary dictatorship. So it's kind of like communism, except its goals are different. So the way it wants to do things is very similar to like Stalinism, but what, it, what the things it wants to do are just different. So yeah, right-wing populists are not going to uh, advocate for like massive controls over the whole society by the government. They're just going to advocate for things like stopping immigration of non-whites or something, which is what fascists believe. So they have they have overlap, but there's significant differences. So it's I don't think it's fair to say Trump is a fascist. It's fair to say he's a right-wing populist, and I think that's that's saying a lot on its own. Also, if you are like a democratic socialist, by comparison, right-wing populism seems like fascism. But it's not. And, um, but yeah, yeah. Just last disclaimer, this is a short video on a very complicated issue, so I oversimplified. So if you have any questions, please ask in the, the down the comments section.